um, but they were very crucial for whatever the next season is. Does that make sense? Yeah, definitely. It reminds me of a quote, right, uh, that I heard from a rapper one time. He said, uh, where we are today is an, an accumulation of our past thoughts. And in order to get to where we want to in the future, we have to change our thoughts now, right? And a lot of the times, you know, these people that have, you know, come into our life, whether it's for a reason, for a season, or for, you know, forever, but uh, they help us come when we are. You can't see now, but uh, to my right, I have a photo wall, right, with all my photos and memories from college and all my photos and stuff from high school and the photos that I'm, you know, that I'm, memories that I'm making now uh, because I, I like to see all the different people that I've been able to, you know, connect with. And a lot of these people I lost touch with, but it's like at some point in time in my life, you know, I had a good experience or a good memory with these people. And every not, once in a while, you know, I just look at my wall and just reflect on it. It's like, oh, shit, that was, that was high school prom, you know, a uh, junior year. Oh, or, oh, that was my last football game or, oh, um, and I was at that one party one time and it's like, uh, or always oh, at that one conference. It's like, I look at this wall sometime. And it's like a lot of these people out there said, you know, I don't talk to anymore. Or sometimes I, I rarely talk to them, but it's like for whatever, you know, the reason season or, you know, purpose that they were put into my life at that given point in time, uh, there's, there's, there's something that was for, and whether it's just for a, a memory, uh, you know, a good time mm -hmm. or whether it's for yep. something deeper that, than that and something that's, you know, actually like meaningful, impactful to your overall course and trajectory. Um, it's up for you kind of to figure that out um, from reflecting. Yeah, it is. And, and and I'm glad you used the word reflecting because the thing is, is that there's a, there's a difference between reflecting and remembering. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so when you remember, you want to refill those emotions you did. So that touchdown you got in, in the last game you played in high school and you got a touchdown or whatever that mm -hmm. moment is, that, that, that feeling you had whenever you graduated high school, you know, whatever these things are, um, you want to relive those, 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 those happy moments in your life, right? That's, that's remembering. <clears throat> When it comes to negative stuff in our life, we only want to do reflection. Reflection is, it's as though you pull yourself out of that emotional piece you were in mm -hmm. and you analyze what happened and you reflect on that and what did I learn and stuff. It's really interesting that um, I talk to my kids about, um, about mistakes and failures and things of this nature. And, um, so I've got 14 year old boy, girl twins. And, um, I tell them, I say, it's okay to make mistakes. It's okay to have failures. I said, um, they hurt and they can be very emotional. I said, but after you get through those initial emotions of what's happening here, those negative emotions, <clears throat> step back and ask yourself one question. What did I learn from this situation? What did I learn from this? And mm -hmm. if you look at um, 